Hello and welcome to the IT Pro TV webinar series live from the IT Pro TV studios. Let's get started with today's topic, Azure Virtual Desktop versus Windows 365, which is right for you. Welcome to the show, guys. Hey, thanks, Peter. Hey, everybody. All right, well, this is a versus uh, uh, webinar here, so we're looking at them against each other. We kind of want to look at the tail of the tape here, but let's go ahead and start with the differences or similarities between ABD and Windows 365 architecture. When we think about Windows 365, what we haven't mentioned yet is there's actually two versions of that Windows 365. There's enterprise and there's business. And enterprise is geared towards you know, a full-on enterprise where you're deploying this across a large number of users versus business is really designed for an individual or a small business uh, that maybe usually goes down to the box store to buy a new laptop when they have an employee. You're not purchasing hundreds or thousands of machines from one of the big vendors. So, and there's some subtle, there are some differences. That's, I shouldn't say subtle. There are some big differences between enterprise and business when it comes to Windows 365. And then for Azure Virtual Desktop, we also have to think about personal versus pooled, but not too much. Most of the things we're going to talk about in here uh, are a stretch across both of those with Azure Virtual Desktop. So just to clear that up as we go through here. 